Dr. Davis, why don't you take a moment and uh, share a few things about the environment that you work in that we call the Physician Studio. Be glad to, Glenn. Thanks very much. The physicians get the opportunity to look at healthcare information in a really remarkably efficient and easy way to access all of the types of records we need for taking care of patients. Now, if you think in terms of the paper charts that physicians use, they oftentimes have to page and page to find what's needed. In the electronic medical record, we have a really user-friendly way to portray information. And if you look at the far screen here to my left, you'll see it's got all of the general information to quickly guide where we need to seek uh, particular uh, patient-related information for a visit. So for instance, in this upper quadrant here, we see the active medication that this patient is on. We also see his diagnosis. We notice allergies. There are vital signs here. And then finally, there's even important laboratory results. So with one view and just a click of the mouse, we can activate any of these quadrants. The way we have multiple screens set up allows it even a greater type of efficiency to care for our patients because we can have multiple pages of a paper chart open, which really couldn't be done, again, using the conventional paper system. So for instance, I've already opened up one electrocardiogram on this gentleman, and let's say I want to take a look at the stress test that this gentleman had uh, some time ago. I double click this quadrant here, and I'm able to bring up the stress test, and now I'm gonna make it so that it's conveniently viewed by me by making it larger, and in doing so, dialogue with the patient can be comfortably undertaken while one just quickly casts his or her eyes who's using the system to the results of the stress test. Another feature that the electronic medical record affords is a way to compare information that's graphical information like electrocardiograms by simply overlaying them, and this is really a powerful tool. So for this patient, what we would do is bring up his most recent electrocardiogram and look at the previous electrocardiogram here. We will increase the size as uh, we just demonstrated with the stress test. And now we're going to go ahead and move this over the cardiogram that we have in place here. And this will be a nice demonstration as to how conveniently and how quickly we can actually work in the electronic medical record to have a unique ability to compare information. So what I've done here is now align the leads between last EKG and this EKG, and it makes it uh, very easy to visualize for this patient. Our system does not use handwriting, but rather employs voice recognition, which we'd like to quickly demonstrate as the way that we craft the clinical note that <clears throat> then is something which can be referred to for the care of this patient going forward. So I'm going to don my voice recognition headphones here and take a moment to activate the system and give a brief demonstration to what the text will be doing as it appears across the screen. Subjective colon, new line capitalize. The patient presents in follow-up and indicates he has had three chest pain episodes since his last visit period. On all occasions, the chest pain lasted only two minutes or less, comma, and the patient did not require nitroglycerin, period. Importantly, comma, the patient indicates he can do as much exercise today as he could when he was discharged from the hospital, comma, and in addition, his breathing has improved over time, period. The patient denies any palpitations, comma, and he has had no episodes of dizziness, period. He is now working out with his prescription for exercise on his home treadmill three times a week, comma, and has had no cardiac symptoms or signs during those workouts, period. New line, new line, objective, colon. And this is how a clinical note for our patients ultimately gets crafted, put in the <clears throat> medical records for a patient, and of course then can be shared across any system that can access this uh, electronic uh, healthcare system.